Hello, I'm the Budget Modeler and this is episode 2 of my 135th King Tiger with interior by Meng and Hetzer Early Bergpanzer by Thunder Models Diorama Build. If you are watching this then please subscribe to my channel, give the video a like and ring my bell. That would be brill. Thank you very much. In this episode there will be considerable snipping, sanding and gluing but no sniffing. First off all the wheels. So with the help of the handy speedy uppy thing let's crack on and get them sorted. But before that here are a couple of pictures I've taken of all 27 sprues in the holder that I made. So that's the sprues. Now let's crack on with the drive sprocket. That's the drive sprocket done. I'm really sorry about the lack of views in that. I'm going to have to take myself around the back of the shed and give myself a damn good talking to. Anyway, it's now the turn of the idle wheels. I'm using an 80 grit homemade sanding stick on this as I personally feel that these will be scuffed. This is the shot I was after on the drive sprocket. See? A good talking to always works. That's the idler wheels done, now the road wheels. I've got these glass pots that I put the different numbered wheel parts in and also mark up which number they are, helps me remember.
Now to sand them down. As with the idler wheel, I'm using an 80 grit homemade sander here to scuff them up. I'm really sorry about this but I'm not going to show the rest of the sanding as one, my hands are just out of shot, all you can see is my knuckles, which I'm really not happy about and two, it's boring. Anyway, on to the gluing of the road wheels. Now, that's the road wheels done, just the hubs to do. Firstly, I've got to mark off what I've done. And now, for the aforementioned hubs. Some have got longer ones than the others. Oi, cheap seed, stop your giggling. Anyway, let's crack on with those. They're done, mark them off and move on to the next hub. That's a better shot. Why didn't I do that first off? Oh well. There we go, that's all the wheels done. Now to move on to the tub. There's a couple of parts at the front to do, so let's crack on with that. There we go, more crap handwork. Sorry folks.
And that's one part of the tub section done. Let's just mark off what we've done here and end this episode. So thank you very much for watching episode two. If you want to see what happens in episode three, then please subscribe to my channel, help it grow, get the message out there to as many modelers as possible. Like the video and ring my bell. Remember folks, stay safe, keep on modeling.